means there's a new way to build content, not writing in isolation, not prompting from scratch, but creating with context, a tool that actually remembers every detail across your entire project. And this is how I finally finished my book. This is five years of work, YouTube videos, architecture diagrams, code examples, all scattered across 20 different tabs and apps. And I just turned all of it into a published book using one creative engine. Hi, I am Alpha Taya and I run the Architects Playbook on YouTube. Over 600,000 developers follow my channel for production grade AI agent tutorials. I have always wanted to turn that into something bigger. A comprehensive book. The Architects Playbook for multi-agent systems. Five pillars, 20,000 words, real production code, structure diagram. The kind of technical resources that actually help engineer ships. But here's the problem. Creating a book isn't just writing, it's organizing, structuring, maintaining voice across chapters, keeping the diagram connected to content, remembering what you wrote three sections ago. The traditional tools are not built for that. Google Documents is static. It's a blank page that does exactly what you tell it. Nothing more. No memory, no context. You are starting from zero every time you open a new document. Chat interfaces like ChatGPT are reactive. They are brilliant for quick answers. But try building a book in a chat thread. Every conversation is isolated. Ask it to match your voice from chapter one when you are writing chapter five. Good luck. Structured tools like Gamma give you templates, a beautiful output, but they are rigid. You are fitting your ideas into their boxes, not the other way around. Most AI is something else entirely. They call it vibe creating, like vibe coding in Cursor, where you stay in the flow while the AI handles all the tedious parts. But for all creators, the creative engine that actually understands your project your context, your voice, across everything you are building. Let me show you what that looks like in practice. Here's the finished workspace. This is the entire architect's playbook. Parent canvas at the top, my command center, five pillar chapters, introduction, conclusion, a bonus chapter on deployment, three appendices, Everything connected in one workspace. Let's look inside Pillar 1, MCP tool integration. Full production code, not pseudo code, not conceptual diagram, actual Python that engineer can copy and run. And notice the diagrams. They are not links. They are not attachments. They live inside the document connected to the content they are describing. Troubleshooting guides with real error messages and fixes. The kind of practical detail that makes a technical book actually useful. What surprised me most, I wrote this over multiple sessions over several weeks. Different days, different moods, different energy levels. Must AI remember my technical voice throughout? I did not have to re-explain my style. I did not have to paste context at the beginning of every session. It's just a new. Let me walk you through how I built this. Everything starts with a parent canvas. This is your project home, where all your content lives and connects. Each major section becomes its own child canvas. For me, that's five pillars plus intro, conclusion, and bonus content. This isn't just organization for organization's sake. Each canvas maintains its own context while staying connected to the parent. That's critical for long-form work. I started each chapter by importing my existing materials. 
YouTube transcripts from past videos, old architecture notes, rough diagram I would sketch. Most in just everything. Raw transcripts, markdown files, code snippets. All of it becomes searchable, referenceable material inside your workspace. Now the magic happens. I select rough content. Maybe a transcript section that's conversational but needs to be tightened for a book format. And Musset rewrites it. Not generic AI slope. Content that matches my voice because it's learned from everything else in the workspace. Here's where it gets interesting. I can reference earlier work directly. It understands that section because it has context in your entire project. This is what separates a creative engine from a chat interface. With ChatGPT, I would need to copy context every single time. Here, the context is built into the workspace. Technical books need more than text. They need visuals that clarify complex concepts. Diagrams generate in line. Not in a separate tool. Not exported and re-imported. Right here, connected to the content. This is MCP connection pool architecture. It lives inside the chapter. Next to the code, it's explaining. When I update the text, the diagram stays connected. Same approach for every pillar. Langer state machine for multi-agent orchestration. Flight deck governance pattern. And here's something I did not expect to use as much as I did. Once a chapter is done, I can turn sections into blog posts. Same workspace, same context, same voice. Or social content, or newsletter sections. One source of truth, multiple outputs. The book is the anchor. Everything else flows from it. Here's what we ended up with. Five pillar chapters covering MCP integration, visual AI automation, land graph orchestration, flight deck governance, and testing with CI CD. 20,000 words, production ready code, six architecture diagrams, three appendices with references, a code repository guide, and a glossary. This isn't a draft, it's a published book Available for purchase, built entirely in Mosset. Now, I want to be honest with you, because that's what this channel is about. Video generation is still early. It's coming. They are releasing it later this month. But it's not the reason why I'm here today. For everything else, like writing, structure, diagram, context memory, this is the most creative workspace I have ever used. I have tried building long-form content in documents, in Notion, in chat interfaces. None of them understood what I was trying to build the way Mosset does. The playbook exists because of what you just watched. If you are building something, a book, a technical documentation, a training, a creative project that lives right now in your head, Musset is the creative engine that will help you finish it. One more thing, the team behind Musset is incredibly responsive. They are four months into building this product and actively listening to users. If you hit bugs or have feature requests, they want to hear from you. There's a Discord link in the description for that. Tell me in the comment what are you creating? What project have you been putting off because the tools were not created? I am genuinely curious and I will see you in the next one.